Hey folks, Rowan at Mike's Bait House here, Indian Pass Outfitters. Welcome to another segment of our fishing report and uh, tackle and tips and things like that for the week. We are coming into the end of September and the fish are really showing up on the beaches. The bait is everywhere. So easy to catch bait, but there's some other things that you can use out there that work just as well. Some pompano showing up, mackerel, oh, trout, everything's showing up on the beach, even redfish. Redfish are traveling to the south, uh, coming from the north. Uh, we're catching quite a few out there on Key Waden. Uh, any of the passes have some in it, any of the rock piles, any of the jetties, uh, they're all going to be around, so get out there and fish. Uh, mackerel, uh, the big schools are still above Tampa or, or close to Tampa, but they are coming down. Smaller fish are down here right now. Uh, one of the greatest things they use for mackerel or anything this time of the year is your splinter, Johnson splinters, or your cast masters. They work great on them. Uh, if you're going to be on the pier though, fishing the mackerel and whatever with the spoons you have to change the treble hook the treble hook is non uh, usable on the pier so you want to get yourself one of these single replacement hooks this is the owner very sharp excellent replacement hook uh, typically go to a larger size you know so the hookup is easier don't go with a tiny one you want to get something that's got a little bit of size to it so owner replacement hook for that on the pier you can do that also anywhere I mean fish it anywhere with a replacement hook a lot less chance of that trouble getting into something you don't want it to be in so anything the other other thing on the pier and, and uh, we just got these in. This is a new company, well not a new company, but a, a custom jig tire out of Punta Gorda. And we're getting these jigs called the Skyline Jig. This is replacing our crazy jigs. Uh, using much better materials, much better hooks in them. Uh, this is a, the same price, $2.99 a piece. Uh, and these are some of the best pompano jigs or any type of a flutter jig uh, that you want. We have them all the way from a quarter ounce up to a half ounce and passes the pier. It works very well. You see how it's a tandem rig? Well, we a lot of times we like to take that little uh, split ring off or take this hook, the teaser hook off and add it to the line about six to eight inches above your actual metal jig on the bottom and then you can take that metal jig and put a little piece of shrimp on it if you want or not so it works both ways have it just like this or you can actually do two baits in one works very good fly of the month for next month is going to be the sparkle crab uh, this is one of my favorite flies for this time of the year especially in redfish season but it works on everything we tie them in about four different colors this is the crystal this is the olive we do them in a brown we do them in a uh, a pink uh, so they work on everything it uh, you can work it like a crab you can work it like a streamer uh, invented that pattern a long time ago still today is one of the best patterns for just about every species redfish snook and i throw them pretty much uh during the whole cold season for bass and peacocks and things like that they're weighted they get down uh, it's an excellent fly for everything so that's going to be the fly of the month for next month and uh, you should enjoy that and come by and pick some up made with fox grizzly hackle uh, estaz so it's a cool fly come check it out mike and mike's bait house is out working today so we are uh, doing the show to you for you and uh, george is behind the camera and he's been working on some jigs here we got some black and purple jigs let's see a jig george uh, this this is a great jig this time of the year we use it offshore, inshore. We have them in all different sizes. It's a black and purple banana head. Uh, George is tying them today. This is a three ouncer uh, and that he tied, very pretty jig. And this is great for offshore, for cobia, grouper, you name it. We tie them in a quarter ounce, three eighths, half, 
for all sizes. Great on tarpon, great on everything. This is a, one of my favorite jigs for the backcountry is the black and purple. Anyway, so thanks to George for tying some up for this week and did a great job on them. A little slow, but he did a great job on them. He's awesome. Uh, he, he works real well. So it's, a, it's good to have an extra hand here doing some tying and whatnot. So anyways, thanks for showing up, coming to Mike's Baithouse. We'll see you next week. Have a good